guys welcome now let's go to the farm okay now like i said this place like typically their major activity is farming so this is a day of for the farm like today i'm not showing any particular food like any particular thing but i'll just show you what these ladies do besides like their rice farm because rice farms are just so many but when they've harvested and they're out like the little pieces of the little portions of land that is beside water they use it to cultivate other things so they're always cultivating like round the clock so let's go into this area and see exactly what they're doing the different things they cultivate all right guys so just come on with me and permit me i have to put on my mask because it's not healthy walking around without a mask here you're prohibited See? Okay, so guys, over here is cassava. Yes, don't ask me why. We can only see a few stems, but this is cassava. It's not the cassava farm. And this particular vegetable, I think it's punky, like what we call punky leaves, but I'm not quite certain. And then we have potatoes. Like this is their own kind of sweet potatoes, and it's really good. Lovely. It's same like what we have back home. So yeah, they cultivate a variety of of crops. As long as it's things that, as in all the crops they cultivate, takes just about a couple of months, three months, two months, and they're ready they, for home consumption and they get to sell in the markets as well. So this is their own source of livelihood, as you can see. She's watering and they do this like every single day, guys. Every day. There's something else I have to show you guys. Now, here it is. This particular plant, I was looking at it, it looks like garden egg, but I'm not certain, I'm not sure. Looks like garden egg, looks like what we call anchia. So is this garden egg? If someone knows, please you let me know because I'm not quite sure. And it goes all the way to the end over there. <laughs> yeah, and over there you see tilled soil. That's how hard their soil is. It's stressful getting to till the soil. See tomatoes? Tomatoes. So you can see the vegetables planted. Now, one thing I must mention with their form or kind of cultivation is they plant in stages. Like in the vegetables, these are younger ones. There are those, there are others that are not yet ready for harvesting, and there are those that are ready for harvesting. As we go on, you're going to see all of that. So what she's watering now, those are ready for harvesting. Every time of the year when she when there is when it's the harvest season. They have something to harvest. Like they're always planting and harvesting things round the year. Okay. <laughs> and this. Kick Huan. Kick Huan. and Nook Kang. Kick Huan and Nook Kang. Mmm. Kick Huan and Nook Kang. Right. King Huai, the Nook King. So yeah, that's how Kokoyam leaves are called. Like that's how Kokoyam is called in their native language. And most of them actually cultivate Kokoyams over here in the provinces. But 
their way and manner of eating it is different from what we know. <laughs> I think I showed you guys how it's even sold in their stores and their shops. So, King Juan and yeah, Nukeng. They cultivate cocoa yams. Some of them use it for decor, okay. right? To decorate their homes. Yeah, I, I okay. know that right, they do. So there you go. Nook now. Nook now. Oh. Xin chào. <laughs> so it's finally my turn to work to water the plants and you can see I'm carrying water and I have to like it was a struggle to actually fill the can. <laughs> it's been a while I did this kind of work so don't come for me. It was a struggle but finally I got it right and I had to go water. And guys, I enjoyed every bit of it. So to some, this might be new, but back from where I come from, it's not totally new, so I enjoy doing this. And for me, it's fun all the way. So this is what these ladies do basically like every day. They can fetch like that for... 50 to 100 times if that's what it takes to get this done they go on ahead and do just that holding back nothing every single day of the life let's go again <laughs> so there's something i must show you guys this particular plant when i first saw it i thought it was granite like from the small leaves and everything then not until i came closer and then i realized it's kind of something like a tree like a tree I was like, goodness, this is not it. <laughs> but it looks so much like granite from the leaves from afar. But when you come up close, you see the stems. No, you know it's definitely not granite. So yeah, that's another thing I almost mistook. But yeah, that's it. <laughs> Thank you. 
Doubting. 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 Mm. Doubting.